tombs. All day long I watch over a town that's broken. Josephat Robert Lage. Every crumbled building is a tomb. We step over gray crushed bricks and the entanglement of steel. The faint scent of death still in the air. Every sliver of laughter dries in the heat, the dust, the stones, the dust, the stones. The doctor offers a wry smile, shrugs his shoulders and says, C'est la vie qui part, oui c'est une terrible. He points to the gray slabs of cement where the hospital once stood. He counts 18. The women in maternity with their babies and their families counting fingers and toes. They were on the second floor. On the first were the diligent nurses. At the top were the broken bodies of the healing. And they are all entombed in the stone. For days the scent of their rotting blanketed our skins. Now, after the blue helmeted soldiers sprayed the ruins, and they've done this before, it is bearable. Death sulks in the corner, like our hearts which leap at each sound of rumbling. The city dances to live, the music leaping against despair. An old woman skips to avoid a truck. This earth devours the dead with such efficiency. And we are left with our heads covered in dust, our eyes searching for familiar faces, our hearts safely tucked away. Mm -hmm.